Hi, I'm Claire from New York. Please like and subscribe. I lived with my amazing single mom who had a tough time raising me on her own. As I grew older, I was determined to work hard and give her a good life one day. I got into a great high school on full scholarship and helped her out by waitressing on weekends. One evening, I was dashing like crazy at the subway station. I was so late for my shift. Suddenly, I bumped straight into someone, but I just shouted an apology and ran off to my train. Just as I was about to get on, someone gently took my hand. I turned around to see the most gorgeous boy ever. Hey, you dropped this. He placed something in my hand and I gasped. It was my bracelet. Thank you so much. I would have been devastated if I'd lost this. I'm so glad I found you. Uh, no, you found me. I mean, the bracelet. His smile went all the way up to his warm brown eyes. You're welcome. Um, do you think we could maybe... Just then the door started closing and I shouted, Sorry, gotta go! As the train pulled away, I felt like such an idiot. I didn't even ask for his name. For the next couple of months, I kept hoping I'd bump into him on the way to work. But <laughs> no such luck. Summer break was over and I was really looking forward to seeing my best friend Tessa, who'd been away on vacation. We hugged excitedly and she put her arm through mine as we walked to class. There's so much I have to tell you. But first, did you ever find the train guy again? No. It sounds stupid, Tess, but we had an instant connection. He almost asked me out, and now he just disappeared. Aw, Claire. We'll hunt the whole city down till we find him. Now come on, let me introduce you to my new boyfriend, David. She walked up to a tall guy, and when he turned around, my heart almost stopped. It was the freaking train guy! He didn't seem to recognize me as Tessa introduced us, telling me how their